Right guys, how are we? What is going on? And welcome back to another video. My name's Jacob. I'm a rugby player. I'm not playing right now because it is summer in New Zealand, but I am a rugby player and I'm giving my reaction to the top 100 NFL players, that's American football, of the year 2020. Um, I'm not going to talk too much in this one. I just want to get into it. We're at number 41. We are in the top half. I don't really need to rush anymore, but I do want to get through these guys. So let's go. All right, climbing's out, huh? I thought somebody's gonna tell me when Clowney's out. Clowney is back in. I hope Clowney's not on the weak side. He's gonna be away from this. Now, if I remember correctly, I, I believe Clowney played for the Chargers. I, I, just, I don't want if Clowney's in the game. Rogers under center. Handle. No, the Seahawks. No, it's not the guy I thought it was. But he was on the list last year. Today they are clowning. He's elite. You don't want that guy running after you. Relentless effort. Really? He does some freaking nice stuff work. right there. Sometimes just does some things that you just like, how, I don't understand how a guy of his size could. Uh, defensive end running like that. Davion Clowney, an American football defensive end, six foot five, 255 pounds, went pick number one of the 2014 draft. I wouldn't have known that. He ran at the NFL Combine a 453 40 yard dash at six foot five and a quarter of an inch and 266 pounds. 37 and a half inches on the vertical jump, 10 foot four on the broad jump, and 21 reps on the bench press. Clowney was selected as the first overall pick by the Houston Texans in the 2014 draft. He, he joined David Carr and Mario Williams as the third player selected first overall by the Texans ever. He was also the first defensive player selected first overall by any team since Williams. On June 6, 2014, Clowney signed a four-year deal worth $22.272 million. Okay, so that was 2014. In 2017, uh, the Texans picked up the fifth-year option on his contract. He was ranked number 32 on the NFL Top 100 Players of 2018. And uh, on March 4, 2019, the Texans placed the franchise tag on Clowney. That doesn't make sense to me because a mere Four or five months later, they traded him to the Seattle Seahawks in exchange for Jacob Martin, Barkevius Mingo, and a third round pick in the 2020 draft. Clowney made his debut with the Seahawks in week one against the Bengals. We move on. September 8th, 2020, he signed a one year deal worth 12 million with the Tennessee Titans. He was placed on injured reserve on November 21st, 2020, with a knee injury. So he went from the Texans to the Seahawks. To the Titans. Let's find out why. Pull that off. Hey, your ass is big today. Your ass is big today. Clowny, I would say. Fuck, it is actually quite big. Hey, your ass is big today. <laughs> I'm not gonna look at it. Your ass is big today. Clowny, I would yeah. say. Yeah, it is. You definitely feel him on the football field. man is, is very different you can't tell if it's power you can't tell if he's going to jump it into a head size swim or what it is every move feels the same bro it did not matter whether jackson or edwards got that ball he was going to smash them that guy just that messes up the whole play for you Ward in motion he gets the quick talk yo Special. He's very disruptive if you let him. And once he get going, that's how he gets stronger. He gets hitting him down! Clowney gets to him! I just whip his ass over. I just whip his ass Often the target of double or triple team blocks, Jadeveon Clowney only had three sacks in 2019. 
but that doesn't mean he wasn't able to impact the game. He's Who was that? Ingram. Oh. That See, that's what you got to do as a running back, man. You got to put your body on the line. To impact the game. He's to block. Causing a lot of havoc and creating plays for other people. Something I respect for guys. You're not always going to show up on a stat sheet, but that I shot was play. epic, bro. It's raining. You know, it's raining. It's an epic tackle. It's in slow motion. That got me. Plays for not only yourself, but for your teammates and affect the game. When it comes time to setting the edge, he's a guy that do a great job of setting the edge. Clowney sprinting, home of golf for the loss of two. Clowney's so athletic. You guys are amazing, man. Yeah, he's got a 454 40 yard dash, a 37 and a half inch, or 453, 37 and a half inch vertical jump. Yeah, he is athletic. Certainly is, especially for that position. He's going to be coming flying for that quarterback. Anyways, guys, that was Jadavion Clowney. I really hope you enjoyed. In the next one, believe it or not, we're looking at this guy, Danelle Hunter. I would, I would have called him Danielle back in the day, but I, I feel like it's Danelle. And with that being said, I'll see you in the next video. If you have liked this one, if you've liked the series, please like it. That would mean a hell of a lot to me. Um, I would put on my Vikings jersey, but I don't have one yet. But what I do have, what I do have is a little bit of, a little bit of Linval, a uh, little bit of Linval Joseph, and uh, well, basically the the colour, the colour's right, purple, bit of yellow, bit of white. It's basically the Vikings. Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed that video. If you have, hit the like button. If you want to subscribe, please do. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.